powerful tool for debugging is this little bug that they've shown here and a similar version of that bug is here. When you click on that, you can actually see what message was passed between the, the little chip over there and the platform in the cloud. The platform in the cloud is like our central post office. It is receiving messages and it is sending them to the destination, right? In this case, the sending and receiving is both happening from one chip, but it can happen with any number of chips. Any number of chips can send messages to this. This can send messages back to any number of chips. So every message can be tracked here with a debug command. And you can see the messages look very complicated, but they will have timestamp. And then if your chip is reporting data, it will show you what the data is. So here our chip is reporting moisture. So you can see the moisture signal. It is greater than 330 because it's out there and it is dry. And what is the weather? So remember we said that we are check we are making a phone call to a weather service to ask what is the weather forecast for the day. And that is the weather data that is coming from that call to that service. And within this buried somewhere is actually the uh, the forecast which tells you whether it's going to rain or not. So that, that is all in the details, but you know, you, you get the idea. Okay. Mm -hmm. So use the serial monitor uh, to, to debug the chip to see that it is receiving signals, able to exchange messages with the post office in the cloud, and then it is able to take action. Use the debug command as well as check the device itself in the Lucent platform to see that all the pieces of the code here are working well and speaking with the device. That's it. Thank you. <laughs>